For the eyes, we'll use the white yarn, the 3.5 millimeter crochet hook, and you're also going to need two safety eyes. And to begin round one, we're going to wrap the yarn around our fingers and do a magic circle. So reach through, bring up your loop, chain one to secure your yarn, and now do six single crochet into that magic circle. And there's two, three, four, five, six. Grab the yarn, pull the tail, or grab the tail, give it a pull, and now we'll place our stitch marker. And at this point, you should have six stitches. For round two, we're going to do one increase in each stitch all the way around. So go into that first stitch, do one single crochet, go back into the same stitch and do another single crochet, and that will be your increase. And now you're going to continue to increase in each stitch all the way around. And at the end of this round, you should have 12 stitches. And here I've come to the end of round two. I'm going to remove that stitch marker and slip stitch into the next stitch and tie off. When you cut your yarn, make sure you leave a long enough tail for sewing. And we'll take our yarn needle and weave in this beginning tail. We don't want to make this too tight, this opening right here too tight, because we do want to be able to slide the stitch marker, or not the stitch marker, the eye, into that space. Now we're ready to attach the eye. So you'll take your safety eye, poke it through that center hole, and then you can take the backing, place it onto that post, and then you push it on. I like to use this as just a stylus that I took the rubber tip off of, and it seems to work pretty good for pushing the backing to the eye. Sure it does. There we go. So now the backing is on and you'll make two of these. And once you have two, you'll be ready to attach them to the head. To attach the eyes, you'll thread your yarn needle and then we're going to center them so we've got the front of the face right here where it curves out. So we're going to have that facing you. And then just center the eyes so they're even. And you'll actually just poke the post through the stitch in the head. And that will help it to lay flat. And now you'll just take your yarn needle, go under a stitch in the head, up through a stitch in the eye, and then we're going to go down through the next stitch of the eye, and then under a stitch in the head. And you'll continue to repeat that, so up through a stitch in the eye, down through the next stitch of the eye, and then under the stitch in the head, and back up through the stitch in the eye, down through the next stitch, under a stitch in the head, through a stitch in the eye, down through the next stitch, 
And you're going to continue to do this until you get back to where you started. And I've just got a couple more stitches here. And then up through the eye, down through the next stitch, under a stitch in the head, up through the stitch in the eye, and then down through the next stitch, which is our final one. And we're gonna go under one more stitch in the head and tie off. So what I did here was I went under the stitch and then before pulling it all the way through, take the yarn needle through that loop and pull tight. And that will make your knot. And then you just take your yarn needle, poke it through the head and cut off the excess yarn and that will hide the tail inside the head. So you do that with both eyes. To add the border around the eyes, you're going to take your yellow yarn and your crochet hook. And you'll go under a stitch in the head as close to the eye as possible and attach your yarn. Chain one to secure. And now we're going to single crochet all the way around the eyes. So find another stitch nice and close to the eye. Go under the stitch in the head and do your single crochet. And then go under another stitch in the head and do your single crochet. And you're gonna keep doing this all the way around, keeping as close to the eye as you can. So that way this kind of frames the eyes. And just keep doing your single crochets all the way around. You don't have to worry about going down through the center between the two eyes. Just go around the outer edges of both eyes. And so just keep doing that all the way around until you get back to where you started. And here I've come all the way around both eyes and back to where I started. So now we'll just slip stitch into that first single crochet and tie off. Cut the yarn. And because this beginning tail is still a little bit loose, I'm gonna go ahead and tie a couple of knots before I hide the tails. Just do two knots real quick. And then we'll take those tails, thread your yarn needle, and then poke the tails into the head. Poke it all the way through. And then we'll cut off the excess yarn. And that hides the tails inside the head. And you can use your yarn needle to Puff that back up if you need to. But there we go, we have attached the eyes.